Coucou bébé, Athena. And we're back again for another another vlog, another day. We're going to take you on another vlog. I don't do enough kind of YouTube uh, fitness stuff on this on this channel, but I will do soon when we move. So loads of cool things to, uh, to look forward to. I'm about to head out to the gym. So today's a very special day. It's my daughter's 1.5 year birthday. Is that even a thing? Apparently it is these days. Any excuse to celebrate this day with you guys. We're gonna take you on a very, 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 very special journey today. We're gonna get some pizza. Now, I don't eat pizza that often, but today is an exception. And today is an exceptional exceptional exquisite restaurant we're going to take you to so i'm going to go and do my workout now it's just going to be one hour's worth of cardio it's going to be 30 minutes on the stepper 30 minutes on the uh treadmill or uh elliptical whatever they call it and then do some stretching because i remember you have to do stretching as you get older very important to be mobile get that mobility going good for the bedroom as well And we're back! Hi! <laughs> Welcome Hi. to the channel again! And today's a very special day as I said. We're going to for lunch at what's the name? Uh, Grosso Napolitana. Grosso Napolitana voted the top 50 uh, pizza no. restaurant. Number no, no, the no, number one pizza restaurant in the world we're going really? to right now. Yeah, it got voted this year. Um, they have like artis artisanal style pizzas. Uh, all the materials come from Italy and it's just a stone's throw away from us. It's like a 10 minute walk. So we're gonna head there now. And we're gonna take you on, again, a culinary adventure today. I'm spending so much money on you guys. But no, we're going for the, what is the menu menu of the day, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty reasonable. How much is around? Uh, 11 90 for like a, a some pizza and uh, plus three euro if you want like some special pizza, like fungi all right so we'll see that it's going to be very traditional italian despite the menu is going to be very small someone's going to take a long time to order hello me yes exactly Never. we'll see how long that takes to order anyway we'll see you in there and we are approaching the famous grosso restaurant that Let's head inside. That's pretty nice. On the table indeed. Same table as we had before. Although, I've been here before but I haven't eaten before. They ate lunch, I was in the gym. Hola, buenas. Uh, Athena? Athena. So, si. Ooh, look at you! Alright, let's all sit down here. Get comfortable. Good atmosphere, smells great. They have real people making real pizza over there. Very cozy. We've got a corner seat. What's your first impressions? Very nice. Lovely. Yeah, yeah, very nice. Very nice. Cool, cool, cool. No, I brought those toys. Toys not included. This is child entertainment. That's not a uh, iPad. So there you go. Yeah, but my first impressions nice warm warm colors very traditional italian and yeah i'm looking forward to to this meal really i'm looking forward to tucking in breaking my breaking my diet for this so um, i've already been to the gym already today burned my 500 calories so 
we should be good. How many, um, what did you do this morning? I lay down watching Netflix and burned about one calorie. But about one calorie. You did chew, chew, did you chew chewing gum today? Sorry? Did you chew any chewing gum? No. Oh, okay. That would have helped burn some more calories. <laughs> Alright. I just, I just chewed my lips. <laughs> Happy 18 month birthday! <laughs> chain restaurant with the awards the awards is called the top it's confusing the awards is called top 50 pizzas but this came number one at the top chain in the whole world I'm really I have high expectations of this I've read a lot of reviews online everyone is ecstatic about this pizza I've just seen some people next to me over there the pizza looks amazing fresh bubbly black you can smell the mozzarella and the, and the Basil, the basil, as you Americans say, and yeah, I just can't. We can't wait to tuck into this, can we? Mm, I'm looking forward. I'm very hungry. <laughs> oh, you're always hungry. All right, I'll see you in a bit. I should really be getting you to order this, since you are the two years Duolingo champion. Do that. Uh, provolite pepe? Which one you want? Yes, I think I know. Pro provolite pepe? Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. See? See? Uh, wow, look at that money well spent there. Uh, 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 Coke Zero. Coke Zero Zero. Zero. Is that included? Yeah. Yeah. Um, inclusive other. Uh, take the take the Coke Zero so you can show that you know, we share Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Are you sharing? Fizzy water, uh, what do you say? Agua con gas, you know what that is? Yes. What is it? Uh, water with um, bubbles. Yeah, or you could say fizzy water. water. Yes. Okay. Alright. Perfect. And here we have some sparkling water. Yeah, Agua con gas. For the Spanish people. Let me taste it. <laughs> <laughs> Francis, you want some? <laughs> Patina, you want some? Oh yeah. Okay, one second. Cheers. Very heavy. It's a very heavy glass. Mm. Happy Monthary. Happy Monthary. And what did you guys order? That's amazing. At this age, you can just give them agua con gas. <laughs> Coke Zero, Zero, in a real glass, in a real glass. And yeah. she's very fussy about the Coke she has, yes. right? This is your favourite, directly from the <laughs> It's not from the Michelin, but it's 350 mils. You know, you go to some places, they give you the tiny... Oh yeah, I know, horrible. Crap. So, cheers. <laughs> this is vodka, is it? <laughs> I haven't drunk for about eight months. 
I haven't drink well, cola. Well, I haven't drank <laughs> since the wedding in Italy. Yeah, yeah alcohol. sure. Yeah, alcohol, yeah. Well, yeah. And say for me, same, same. You pare your man. the pizza, so see you in a minute. Oh my good gosh, look at this. Wow. I'll put the description of the pizza down below because I can't remember what I ordered. What's your first impressions of that pizza? Well, it's very appetizing and I could just get stuck right into that. It's that this lovely juicy mozzarella. Number one pizza in the world. Let's have a look at this. What's this one? Quattro formaggi. That looks good. Oh, 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 look. Smile, smile for the camera. And me. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> too good. Looks too good, so I'm gonna cut it. Yeah, we're nose. gonna eat now. And um, as I said, let's get. I said to my mum, let's get pictures before she eats. <laughs> and she takes a bite out of that. I, I, need thought, to... you, I thought you were too <laughs> What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? First taste test. Delicious. Oh, there you go. Usually, your favorite word is nice. Nice, but well, this is delicious. <laughs> no, you want to cut? I would cut it, then have a slice. No, otherwise, no, you don't. Okay, well, all right. All right. fair enough. Hmm? Get them lickety fingers on camera. Tastes as good as it looks, right? Yes. First impressions. Magical. Mm. Is that the best pizza you've ever tasted? Yeah, though? Yeah. Really, the, the best ever. Yep. I told you then. All right. Okay. Do I have a knife and fork, yes? Yep. I'm tasting this. Not for me. For you. Right. I'm gonna it's zoom on your mouth <laughs> and your face. <laughs> it's nice and it's kind of soft. You can feel it. it's really soft and doughy, which I love. It's not like the New York pizzas, right, where it's like tough oh, and yeah, bottom, it's not, and not crispy, but you can see that there. Yeah? In England, we say it's very Mmm. Mmm. I've never tasted a better foggy bottom. In my, in my life. Really good. I'm gonna add some chili oil to this. This is virgin uh, olive oil. Extra, Extra virgin. virgin. With um, cayenne. cayenne pepper. Oh, no, no, it's not chili. No, okay, cayenne, pepper. cayenne. Cayenne. Oh. Five stars. Hands down. <laughs> Even on the price as well. The price point, the dough is fresh. The basil just elevates the dish. <laughs> oh my god, that's so good. I've been watching Jimmy's TV. I've been watching Jimmy's TV. Athena killed her slice already. It's so chewy. It's so, so chewy. Nice. I love it. Okay, now I'm gonna eat as well. We're gonna see you there. See all of that. Don't forget, comment, subscribe, hit the like button because we need the algorithm. We need to make some money for our college funds. So, <laughs> if you've been here before, comment down below. Halfway through, who's in the lead? Karen's in the lead. Mm. Halfway through as well. Still playing around. <laughs> Let's get the rest of this. Thank you. What's the motivation behind this? You well, were just I saying. Just like to have a clear table. Huh? She thinks it's too long. She I thinks just like to have a clear table. This is true. They left our place here. And what's the what, what should waitresses really do in your opinion? Well, the waitress should scan the table with their eyes very quickly and take away empty bottles, empty glasses, anything that's no longer being used or required. Is this indicative of this particular restaurant or the general consensus it's of the general consensus in the year 2023? Of most waitresses don't do that anymore, do they? Well, in my, in my humble opinion, no. Mm -hmm. 
Food for thought. So if that happens to you, if you're at a restaurant and you see the waitress and she doesn't take away your plates, is that normal for you? Is that okay for you? Um, is that a new phenomenon? I don't go out enough to, to notice. Again, terrible Spanish. Perdón. Just don't worry. No, my mum. They're gonna take. They're gonna take them out. Yeah, but she's gonna listen. Yeah, right. It's okay. Yeah, but, no, it's fine. I'm, yeah. I'm when she comes, it's alright. Yeah, it's fine. All right. So let me just taste this again. <laughs> oh, it's good. Anyway, we're gonna close out here. This is probably the best restaurant, pizza restaurant I've ever been to. The quality is absolutely amazing. The guy's making it fresh by my side over there. The ingredients are amazing. The service is pretty good. It's up there, it's not the best, but it's pretty good. Everyone seems to enjoy themselves, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah? Amazing. It's amazing. And the price point as well. How much? 11.90. 11.90. Okay, can you see it on the screen? 11.90. 11.90 for all of that. You've got the pizza, you've got the drinks, and you've got the dessert, which is also like the coffees and the teas included. And you've got the atmosphere, and you've got the family, and you have the love. So, if you want to come to a restaurant here in Valencia, you want pizza, come to this place. If you've been here before, comment, subscribe. Tell me about your experience here. Was it good? Was it bad? Was the, were the waitresses even better than they were today? Because they weren't that great, to be honest. But they were nice, they were kind, and they spoke English. So, last comment? Yes, come and eat and experience the beautiful food that they have to offer here at Gross. It's called Gross, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> It's gross. It's gross. It's gross. 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 Gross.